Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video and today we're talking about iOS 18. Now the first rumors and reports regarding iOS 18 are actually pretty exciting. This seems to be a big update and it might even be the biggest update to iOS till today. But which are the devices that will be supported by this new software update? And of course, whenever you expect a big update, you can also expect Apple to drop support for a few devices. So first of all, let's take a look at the current list of the devices that are supported by iOS 17. You know that the devices that all the oldest ones supported by iOS 17 are the iPhone XS, XX Max, and the XR. Those are the oldest devices are currently being still updated by Apple. And Apple did drop support for a few devices last year. The iPhone 10, the iPhone 8 series have been dropped with iOS 17. And the same will most likely happen this year as well. Even though to have this all confirmed, we will have to wait for WWDC 2024 to actually take a look at these like devices that will be supported. But currently we have here a few like different reports and different rumors regarding the supported devices and it will most likely be that way. So WWDC 2024 will take place on the first week of June here. That's when we will have the official list of the supported devices. But here's what I expect to happen. The iPhone XS, XX Max, and the 10R will be dropped this year. They won't be getting iOS 18 and I'm 99% sure that that will actually happen. But the other devices are actually quite old like the iPhone 11, 11 Pro and the 11 Pro Max are in my opinion doubtful. We can maybe have those updated to iOS 18, maybe not. We will have to wait for those and the iPhone SE second generation. Those are the devices that have the A13 chip, so we will have to wait and see for that, but I'm really doubtful that Apple will actually support those devices as well. Because as you probably know, those devices are actually quite old and with the new updates that Apple is bringing to iOS 18 and with all the cool new features and all the redesigns and the AI features that we're expecting to get on the new iOS 18, we will most likely have quite a few devices drop this year because that software update of course will require quite a lot of power to actually work and have all the features work as they should. But again, we will have to wait for WWDC 2024 to see the official news from Apple, but just expect the iPhone XS, XS Max and the XR to actually be dropped this year and maybe, but hopefully not, the iPhone 11 series and the iPhone SE second generation. So that's basically it for this video guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. For more iOS 18 news, make sure to subscribe and of course leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it and I will see you on the next one.